That's the cable Gabba was talking about, right? Looks like the other side of the cable is right by that huge sign welcoming people to Happy Dale. Ideal for my escape. When it's time to escape, I just put the forceps around the cable, hold on tight, jump, and slide down. Well, I think I've done everything I needed to do. That psycho Kurgan is so Brianized, they'll think his body is mine. And besides that, I know how to slide down the cable on the roof now. I'm gonna go back to my room to wait for the right time to escape. When the sun goes down, I'm free as a bird. Hold him down, Ernie. Your pleasant little stroll is over, Basco. Hey, Miss Palmer. Basco's all worked up. He needs the anesthesia. Get him back to bed. He clearly needs more medication. Fed me some nasty meds. What did she give me? Ernie! Was this the pill? Careers, Basco. That was the one. <laughs> Keep writing, Ernie. Will do, Basco. I have to find out what the effects of neuroshockine are. I can't risk losing it when I'm escaping from this place. Okay, but just for 30 seconds. Tops. Hi there, I'm Mickey. Hi there, Who are I'm you? Mickey. Who are you? It doesn't matter. Just answer. You look nervous. Of course I do. In five minutes is the last episode of Barbara's Crest. And as soon as it's over, I have to rush my butt over to the university to take my pharmacology three exam. It's like the most important day of my life on two totally different fronts. Ready for your big exam? <laughs> I've memorized it all. Ask me whatever you want. So what the heck do I ask you? You gotta ask me about some drug, and I'll tell you everything I know about it. Neuroshockine XR. Neuroshockine XR, chemical composition, hypopendulic acid, dosage administered orally, used only to resuscitate the sick who are clinically, clinically, uh, clinically, uh, dead. Dead. In any other type of patient, it causes acute neural excitation, which results in attacks of extreme violence in the patient, which... Uh... What? Miss Palmer gave me pills to make me ultra-violent? Yes, of course. That knife under my pillow was her doing. That's how she knew about my candy. And then she wouldn't give up until I took those pills. Is she trying to get me to kill someone? What for? Does she hate me that much? The important thing now is to find some sort of antidote. Which can only be neutralized by taking... Uh, by taking... A direct electrical shock. Uh, a direct electrical shock of high voltage applied to the back of the neck. In other words, either you jolt the guy with electricity or he starts to go postal and kill everyone in sight. Thanks a lot, Mickey. You just saved my life. Next question. Can you lend me the taser inside of Miss Palmer's purse? Basco, I never took you for a thief. A nutcase and a murderer, yeah. But not a thief. Come on, dude. She's not gonna notice. I'll give it back to you later. Ernie, I don't sell out for nothing. Well, maybe for cash. <laughs> Keep writing, Ernie. Will do, Basco. Man, after what he told me about... Ernie, do you think the casino chips Gabo gave me are fake? I doubt it. How much are we talking about here? 
$125,000. $125,000? I'd like some of them chips myself. Yeah? Well, go figure that they're not at all that appealing to me. I'd even give them up in exchange for, I don't know, a taser gun? Basco, never, ever, ever will you get me to take that taser out of Miss Palmer's purse. And you know that never means... How cool. Be careful, Gabo. One shock and that's it. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> Basco? minutes till the changing of the guard. Get going! Miss Palmer can- Give me your cell phone. Why? If it goes as planned, they'll contact Gina to have her identify Kurgan's headless cadaver. I've got to warn her. She has to tell them the body's mine. Hey, who's there? <gasps> oh my gosh, that bicycle fell is dead! Up there! It's Kurgan! Kurgan! Stop right there! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, my God.